Natural resources can be broadly categorized into two main types, renewable and non-renewable resources. Renewable resources are those that can be naturally replenished over time, either through natural processes or human intervention. Examples, solar energy, the sun continuously provides energy, and technologies like solar panels harness sunlight for electricity. Wind energy, wind is a constantly replenished resource that can be converted into electricity using wind turbines. Hydropower, the energy of flowing water is harnessed to generate electricity through dams and turbines. Biomass, organic materials like wood, crop residues, and animal waste can be used for energy production. Non-renewable resources are finite and cannot be replaced on a human timescale. Once they are depleted, they are gone. Examples, fossil fuels, coal, oil, and natural gas are non-renewable sources of energy formed from the remains of ancient plants and animals. Burning them releases carbon dioxide into the atmosphere. Minerals and metals, resources like iron, copper, and aluminum are extracted from the Earth's crust, but are not replaced at a rate comparable to their extraction. Nuclear fuels, uranium, used in nuclear power plants, is a non-renewable resource. Semi-renewable Semi-renewablerceris, some resources fall between renewable and non-renewable categories, depending on the rate of use and regeneration. Example, forests, while trees can be replanted and forests can regenerate. The rate of deforestation can outpace regeneration, making it a semi-renewable resource. Conclusion It's crucial to manage both renewable and non-renewable resources sustainably to ensure their availability for future generations. Overexploitation of renewable resources or rapid depletion of non-renewable resources can lead to environmental degradation, loss of biodiversity, and economic challenges. The shift towards sustainable practices and the development of alternative renewable energy sources are essential for long-term environmental health and human well-being.